Hi everybody and welcome back to some more racing here on this channel. This is KPG Gooner here and in today's video we're starting a new career walkthrough on the excellent MXGP2. Now I've been really looking forward to this. Now if you like bikes and you like motocross this is going to be the walkthrough to watch. Now um, in today's video we're going to start off create our, our rider, our team and all that stuff. Get into some practices, just see what the game's like and then get into our first career race this is going to be really good right let's get straight into it here we go right so we're just creating our rider so we've called ourselves uh, kpg and surname guna and nickname guna right let's put my favorite number number 14 let's just choose the styling of the uh, lettering oh that looks pretty good um which one should we go for oh, that's too small uh I think we go with that one. Right, so skin colour. Although you don't see much of your skin with all that uh, gearing on. And nationality. Let's change that to Great Britain. Where's Great Britain? Oh, there it is. Right. Let's get into uh, choosing our team. Here we go. We're nearly finished. But I've got a few motocross videos which could help you out if you want to learn from the champs. Want to watch them now? Right, so we're just going to check out some uh, tips and tricks on the game first, quickly. Right, let's get straight into it. For a good start, you need quick reflexes and coordination. Before the start, press the clutch, put your weight on the front, and accelerate until the limit of threshold. As soon as the gates go down, let go of the clutch and give it full gas. If you manage it at just the right time, you have a good chance of pulling off a whole shot. The clutch can be useful if you find yourself jostling for positions in the middle of a race. On slow corners or hairpins, you need power and thrust to get going again. In these cases, hit the clutch and let it go immediately after accelerating. Once again, coordination is everything, but with a bit of practice, I'm sure you'll master this technique. There are many ways of managing speed on corners, and you need different approaches according to the effect you want to achieve. On wide bends, just use the engine brake. If you calculate the distance well and arrive to the curve prepared, you shouldn't have to worry about the brakes. If you want powerful braking instead, use the front brake. It'll have an immediate effect with a short stopping distance. But don't overdo it. Only the best riders can do this without ending up face down in the mud. The rear brake is really useful when you want to combine braking and turning. Use it on hairpin bends or for tight, precise trajectories. When you accelerate, think about what kind of bend lies in wait and what kind of trajectory you want to set. On broad corners, keep straight and turn by dabbing the accelerator. If the corner is banked, lean into it, taking advantage of the inner side. This will enable you to leave the corner much faster and with the gas open. In both cases, remember that you can tighten the line of the curve even more by moving your weight to the front wheel. Never underestimate the importance of a good trajectory. If you want to be fast, this is where you need to start. Right, that sounds pretty challenging. Right, we're not going to go through all of them. Let's jump straight into a practice and have a go for ourselves. Here we go. Okay, now we're fully set. Let's do it. Right, let's jump straight into the career. Here we go. Okay, now it's time to get serious. Your first world championship tasks will be two wildcard races with your custom team. The team is ready and we all believe in you, but we have to sign with a sponsor to compete in the championship. This is who has come forward so far. Right, so we've got to choose a sponsor. Uh, I've got no idea how good any of these teams are, so I'm just going to select any, any of them. that do. I can see you've got the right idea. Remember that all sponsors expect a minimum position in every race. Respect this, and I won't have problems keeping them on board. A true champion gets things done off the track as well. Here's everything you need to follow the season. Test the bikes and manage public relations. By the way, 
Keep an eye on the mag. It might be talking about us too. Right, let's just quickly check out uh, what the customize is. Let's have a look at that. Oh, so you can customize your rider, bikes, and team. We're not going to go too much into that in today's video because we want to get some gameplay. So these are the two bikes you've got, the MXGP bike and the MX2 bike. Right, let's try and get into the first race. Here we go. Just one more thing. Before every race, I'll recommend an opponent you need to beat. Make sure your bike finishes ahead of theirs and watch your reputation grow. Right, so that's the rider challenge that we've got to do. So that's choose an outfit. Um, let's go for that one. Right, have a look at the bike. That's the bike we've got. We've gone for the Honda. Hopefully that will serve us well. We're not going to adjust the bike. Let's get straight into it. Here we go. Right, let's get into some qualifying uh, that, and test out this track before we get into the race. We're not going to do too many laps we've got like 30 minutes to get a good time in we just have a, a lap or so to see what it's like so far it's not too bad right i've got to get used to using l1 clutch l2 for back brake uh r2 for accelerate and i think x for uh front brake i get tight oh god run that a bit wide just get the hang of it uh using the clutch to get a bit more speed around the corners oh damn we've got someone just Oh, God, he's just whizzed straight past me. Not getting the greatest speed through this. Just trying to get around the corner. Oh, God. <laughs> this is going to be really tough. This is a lot more difficult to control than I thought. Let's try and get nice and tight to that corner. Yeah, I took him in the inside. Just, I was using both brakes then. And again, let's try and get nice and tight. Not just... This is... It really is hard to, to handle, actually. It's quite difficult to control. But I'll try and keep it on the track as much as we can. Um, I do believe it's like uh, most uh, uh, game, motorbike games, you can, in the races, use rewinds and looks. You've got nine rewinds for the practice, but I shouldn't need to use them for a practice, surely. Let's just try and get uh, one lap under our belt before we jump into our first race. And I do believe in, the, in each championship race, there's two races. So we're got, going to have to do two races around this, this circuit. So hopefully we can at least get the rider challenge and beat the guy to get the, uh, the maximum points. But um, this is on a, a medium level. I mean, I've never, I've never done a game like this before. I mean, I do MotoGP games, but I've never done a motocross games. Oh God, went off. Oh, I can't bother to rewind. Yes, that's rewind actually. We can do that better. Let's use a rewind. Right, let's try and take that corner a bit better here. Oh, he went right up the inside of me, but let's just try and finish this lap off. Ah! Almost went into the stands there. Right, I do believe that's the end of the lap. Right, let's accelerate around the corner. Let's see what position. Ah! Could have into the crowd. Right, so we got fifth. I'm going to leave it there. So we know what the circuit's like now. So let's quickly return to the pit. And we're forward the time on, on the qualifying quickly. Let's just skip through it. This, what button skip? Oh, R1. Right, let's quickly sk skip through it all. And obviously we've got miles down the bottom. Probably going to finish in last. But um, yeah, what was the top time? 1.38. God dear, we're, we're quite off that. Hopefully we can do better in the first race. But um, that's that starting, using the clutch, that should be really good. Hopefully we can get a good start. And uh, finish uh, in front of the rider that we've got the challenge for. Right, let's get into the first race. Here we go. Right, so here we go with our first race. Um, so we can start really wide. So there's 22 riders. So I'll take it. The better your time, the closer to the inside you get. So uh, we're right on the outside. Let's see if we can get a good start using that clutch, like it said on that uh, tips. Oh, that was a brilliant start. I just let the clutch out at the right time, but he gone straight to the lead. But we're all out wide. Can we get tuck in and get a good position? And we're up to P3 at the start of the race. That's brilliant. Oh, took that a bit wide. Didn't get the brakes on. Let's try and use that clutch when we go around those, those corners and let it out to get a good drive. And we've dropped another place, P4. This isn't a bad start. Ah, 
Almost went straight into the, the barrier there. We're probably going to have to use some rewinds in this race. Let's just try and be nice and aggressive. Let's try and get up the inside of that bike there. But we ran it wide and he's going to take the place back. So we've dropped down to P6. Can we get up the inside again? Yes. So we're back into fifth. But he's really, really trying to get past me there. Let's just try and settle down. We're not going to uh, be able to catch those in front of us, I don't think. They're just pulling away. We haven't got the speed. We were miles behind on the qualifying times. But uh, once you've got the hang of the game using the clutch, the brakes, and uh, just knowing where to uh, slow down and... Damn, shall I rewind? Yeah, I think I'm going to rewind. Have to use my first rewind. We're probably going to have to use a few a few on this game. Right, let's try and get a better line through that. And that's a bit better. We're definitely going to have to use uh, the rewinds at the start of the career because it's going to take a while to get used to it and learn all the circuits. Right, let's get nice and tight in here using both brakes. So when you use both brakes, you can get a tighter turn. But... Uh, I think it said on that tips not to use the brakes too much. Otherwise, you lose a lot of speed. And we've got to get a good drive up these hills to get a good good air. Right, let's try and get nice and tight around this corner. Ah, I've lost the place. Ah, and I've fallen off again. Right, <laughs> rewind. <laughs> That's not bad so far. I thought I'd come off more than this. Right, let's try and get a better line through here this time. Right, we're coming up to the end of the first lap. And we're in sixth. It's not a bad start considering we qualified in uh, last position. Let's try and go through there fast and we've taken fifth. All right, let's start this lap and try and chase down the uh, the bikes in front if we can. All right, we're taking a tighter line through there. Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> Went off the course and got stopped. Right, let's just rewind that again. Got to take that corner a bit better. Right, let's just try and hold this position. Fifth wouldn't be bad for my first race considering my qualifying uh, position but uh, so far this game is this is fun but it's 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 a tricky game it's going to take a lot of practice oh damn oh and i've come off again yeah it's going to take a while to practice so let's just rewind that again let's try and avoid that bike he turned straight into me you've got to be quite aggressive on this i think try and hold your position to not let all the other bikes through Let's try and get up the inside of the bike there. No, not close enough. Let's go on the outside if I can. Now, try to use the clutch to get a bit of uh, drive through that corner. He's, get out of the way. I can't get past him. Let's try and get up the inside again. No. Uh, can we get... Yes. We did it. Brilliant. We've taken our fifth place back. Come on. Let's at least get fifth. This is a better second lap so far. I think we're running slightly quicker than our last lap. Let's see if we can beat that 147. See if we can catch up. Hopefully some of the other riders fall, fall off in front of us and we can take their position if we can. All right, let's get a nice... Right, we've got another tough corner here. Well, that's much better. Get, sort of getting the hang of the braking and when to use it and not to use it. Well, we've got another race after this, guys. So hopefully, if we don't do well in this one, we can improve in the second race. Ah, just run that wide a bit. Got to be careful we don't go off the side. Oh, God. Oh, oh get I'm down again. Damn you. You've got to be so careful. It's so easy just to go over the jump and go off course. Right, let's go take a better line. And I've got to, I've done it again. Oh, damn. I can't rewind now. I've lost position. I've dropped down to eighth. No, I'm not having that. Oh, sorry. I'm not that guy off, but never mind. He got him away. So we've got to sixth position at the end of the second lap. We've got one more lap. And let's see what the lap time was. Oh, we did a 141. So we improved by... Oh, God six seconds so uh i think in the qualifying the fastest lap time was 138 so we're not far away for our first go um it's like i said it's on uh, i think a medium level it's going to take a while and a pretty one career walkthrough if we can do really well in this first one then we'll start up in the level we we'll do the same as what we do in the motor gp where we start on the low sort of a lower level and then we start up in the level once we start uh competing for uh the podium places in these uh, races. Right, so let's get nice and tight around this corner. I'm in seventh at the moment. We dropped a couple of places when we we came off, but um, we gained one more place because we dropped down to eighth, didn't we? So if we can finish in seventh, I mean, that wouldn't be the, the end of the world. Let's see if we can catch up this guy. I'm just trying to get the drive up the hill, and he went slow around there, and he came off. Yes, I'm back into sixth. Let's try and hold sixth. Come on, we can do this. Just run it wide there. Get 
Yeah, nice drive. Nice and tight into this corner now. Just using the back brake there. Not so much the front brake and slowing us right down. Yeah, we're getting the hang of it now. I feel we can... Once you've learned the course, you can you know where you can accelerate and where you have to go a little bit slower. Right, let's try and go over this a bit better, not go off the side. See, we've improved. That's much better. Let's get nice and tight around here. Oh, we've been taken. Damn you. Oh, God, we've lost a place. Oh, no, we're going to lose another place. Oh, God, I went off course, and it doesn't rewind when you do that. I think we're going to get seventh and finish. Oh, I can't believe I mucked that corner up right at the end. But uh, seventh place, and I don't know whether we... Did we finish above that rider for the rider challenge? I don't think we did. I can't remember what his name was. But uh, we've got a second race. No, we didn't get the bonus for beating that uh, guy. Let's see if we can do it in the second race. Right, let's jump straight into the next one. Here we go. Let's see if we can get a better start in this one. And get a better line. So we're, we're, we're in a different part. We're in a different part of the, uh, the line up there this time. Because we finished seventh in that race. So we got a better line through there. That wasn't a bad start. And again, we've had a good start. And we're up to third. We seem to do well at the start. It's just holding it. Right, they're really... They're a lot quicker than me, the uh, front uh, few bikes. I run a dangerous line through there. I thought it was going to come off, but I just managed to hold on. And we're just trying to fight for this third position. Oh, again, I ran it wide through that corner. Didn't use enough front brake. Let's see if we can get past. <laughs> I've knocked someone over. Oh, damn. Oh, so annoying. I could have rewind there, but I thought, no. We're not doing too bad. Sixth position still. I'm only going to use a rewind if I lose majorly. We only lost a couple of places. Ah, wheelie! <laughs> Why did I stay on then? Just managed to hold it there. So we're back up to fourth position. Let's try and stick with this uh, guy in front at the end of this first lap. See if we can improve on our time. So I think the best we hit was at 140. And again, we came off circuit there. Could have rewind, but I'm just trying to not use him if I really don't have to let's see if we can gain those places back we're only in sixth at the end of this first lap let's see if we can get up the inside of this one here oh that went bad held it ah bloody hell rewind went straight into the mx gp uh post then right let's just hold this I'm going wide again we know we can accelerate through this uh last bit going over the finish straight Ah, just try to hold this guy off and just hold fifth position. Right, let's try and get the, the inside of these two here. No, wasn't close enough, and I've gone out wide instead. But we're not doing too bad. That first first lap was okay. Right, come on, come on, we can do this. Come, on, we've got to do better than we did in the first race. Oh, come off again. Rewind. I do apologise, guys, but the rewinds are here for a reason. On this sort of game, it's you, I don't think you're ever going to get a completely clear race without coming off or coming off the circuit. It's, it is so hard to control. But hopefully in this career walkthrough, I will improve race from race to race. And uh, we can obviously adjust the bike. We haven't done any of the adjustments. They're all on default settings at the moment. The gearing and the handling. But uh, hopefully our bike will improve definitely not the fastest bike on the circuit but we've managed to catch up here can we take another place and he came off the circuit so i'm back up to fifth right, let's try and hold fifth position at least in this race let's try and catch that bike in front of us that's not a bad line through that corner but it's so hard when you take it wide and then you try and turn in if you overdo it you literally turn right around the corner and it puts you out on the next corner it's really difficult just got to hold a decent position going around the corners. And not to turn too much. Right, let's try and get a better line for this corner. And avoid hitting that MXGP uh, banner. And we just lost a place there. But can we gain it around this corner? Really accelerate through here. Nearly up to maximum speed. Right, one more lap to go. 
and we've hit a 138 so we're definitely improving and that was the uh, top time in the qualifying so we definitely could have got a first position in qualifying uh, riding at that pace so we're improving that's the main thing I oh, know he's just overtaking me I think he took that corner a little bit better than I did to try and get up the inside try and hold the position thought it was going to come off there and I'm running up off the course right let's try and get up the inside Oh, God, the gainer didn't break soon enough. And someone else has taken my place, you git. Get out of my way. I'm not having this. I want at least fifth. No, he got a better line through that corner. Oh, this is going to be a fight to the end of the race, I think. Let's just try and stay with him. Let's try and get a better line down here. Ah, oh, got him on the outside. Use the clutch then. Just let it roll down. Hold the clutch in. Revved it up. And I've got a good drive up that hill. And someone's crashed out. Is that someone in front of us? I don't know. Want to start learning the names of the riders. You'll know who's in front of you and who's behind you. I hope you're enjoying this first experience on, on this game. I hope you stay with uh, this walkthrough. It's going to be loads of videos on this. Plus, we'll be carrying on all the other walkthroughs we're doing at the moment on the channel. Right, one more corner. Tough corner. And he's trying to take me here. No, I don't want to lose my place. No, I wanted to get fifth. Ah! Oh, no, I'm going to lose it. Let's just try and accelerate past him here. Come on. We can get him on the finish straight. Come on, just get to the inside. Oh, we're going to hold fifth. Yes! We got fifth in our second race. Now, that second race was a hell of, hell of a lot better. I'll take that all day long. And uh, did we finish uh, in front of the rider for the bonus yes we did that's absolutely brilliant so we've got some credits to spend i hope you enjoyed this first video on this uh, first experience on mxgp2 and i'll see you soon for some more in the next video thank you very much for watching and bye bye